This is a K-Line Starlight Diner. It's the first one that was ever produced by them. They made several different versions of this later on in New York Central, Pennsylvania, etc. Originally, it had a sound uh, system that played something sort of like the twist, I think, or something like that. Uh, it doesn't work. Um, I'm not sure if somebody had accidentally touched uh, the sound uh, clips that are on the bottom uh, to power. You're not supposed to do that. It just closes the circuit. In that case, they may have burned out the chip that's on the board. Uh, I'm using 14 volt bulbs and they're 252s. They're sandwiched between the uh, glass signs. One, I guess, says coffee, and another one says open. And there's a little pocket that uh, they fit in uh, on the aluminum rails that are on the bottom of the car. And of course, the end cap will go in as well. I put a screwdriver in the smoke unit just to help fish it through the hole. Uh, you can also run this where the smoke unit is on its separate transformer, and uh, that might cut down the smoke a little bit. I just gave it a good shot of juice, smoke fluid, so it's going to crank that out. You know that these K-Line uh, smoke units go through the smoke pretty fast. All right, we replaced the bulbs up there in the Starlight Diner. The whole uh, board that contains a bunch of bulbs is available from Lionel. Uh, also found the streamlining uh, assembly. It's a whole bunch of bulbs that screw to the top of the roof. There's a rail and there's a couple uh, brackets that slide along here and then the screw takes it. So you actually have four circuits going on there. All right. My plugs and connectors varied a bit. I only had a single plug and it was black and it's a little longer and it doesn't have the snaps on the side like you see on these white ones here so you may have to do some rewiring to make yours compatible my connector varied a little bit from what's shown here it was black two pin and the pins were a little bit longer but uh, a number of bulbs seem to be about the same so i suspect this would be work on the Starlight Diner, it probably was used in some of the later issues. From the Lionel website, uh, the Starlight Diner was of course produced before Lionel bought them out, but the base on the bottom and the instructions seemed to work the same. 